Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the steps to install the Windows 10 May 2021 update also known as version 21H1 applying the update KV5736 which is the enablement package that flips the switch to 21H1 from version 2004 or 20H2 if you're using version 1909 or an older version you cannot use this option the reason is that Windows 10 version 2004 and 20H2 have a common core with the 21H1 file system. As a result, the changes can be applied with a single package. Using this approach significantly reduces the time to upgrade and lowers the restart times to only one. So if you want to upgrade to version 21H1 and you're not getting the notification from Windows Update and you know your computer is compatible, then use these steps. First, open the settings app and then go to system and on the about page make sure to confirm that you have at least version 2004 or version 20h2 well on this page also confirm your system type which in this case is 64 bit but it could be 32 bit on your installation and that is because you need to know this information to download the correct package to install on your computer Furthermore, you want to go to Update and Security and then on Windows Update, make sure to check for updates because to install the enablement package, you need to have the KV500371 update installed on your computer, which was released on May 11, 2021. Once you know that you have the update, you know the system type, and that you have the correct version that you can upgrade through this process, you need to download the package. In my case, I have a 64-bit version of Windows 10, so I'm going to select this link. And by the way, I'm going to be leaving these links on the video description so you can copy and use it on your computer. Then open your web browser and paste the link and press enter to download. I already have it downloaded, so I'm not gonna save it. Once the download completed, double click the package. Make sure to close any running applications. And click the yes button to apply the update. and then click the Restart Now button. And that's it. If you want, you can double check that you have the update installed on your computer by going to the Settings app and then on System about under the Windows specification section. The version number now is going to be 21H1. And that's how you update manually to version 21H1 using the enablement package on Windows 10. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.